So, Operation Payload, what does this consist of? So, attention agent, prepare to move or stop the payload to earn intel and lock more tech. So, as you can see, you do have the truck, you have your teams. You can basically just get it from one area to the other without the truck being stopped. So, yeah, you got to protect it, basically. Protect the bomb, should we say. Um... Do go halfway once you either reach your destination or you do get stopped and don't reach it in the allotted time, then it is game over. You do then swap sides and retry. Quite a good, exciting game. Quite quite fun, to be honest, if that's your kind of uh, cup of tea. Yeah, so do dive in and have a look. So we also have the Heavy Sniper. Ghost agents have tampered with heavy snipers to retune their effectiveness. Infiltrate a shadow hideout to find one. What does this mean? What does it consist of? Um, I haven't actually found one yet, so this is all theories to me. But as you can see, we got a new sleek design. It looks damn sight more beastly. Also, it does have a tripod stand, so whether this here can be mounted um, does stop the sway, make it a bit more accurate. Wondering if the actual power up and on has actually changed whatsoever. Um, be good to find out. Do comment down below, guys, in the comment section what do you think. If you have played it, do let me know what the effectiveness is actually like. So, what do we get with version 12.50? Let's dive in and have a quick look. So you do get a time trial. You can do these on land or out in the water. Quite a good little uh, that they've done. You can all change your appearance mid-game. So this, you just jump into any blue telephone boxes. Choose what you want. Quick back out. Take a second to go. Marshmallow. Yep. Jump back on in. Go back to Jack. Back out again. Quite a good little um addition, I would say. I'll go personally. You've got Bunger Bow. Got the paint grenade launcher. So you do have a paint bottle files, whatever you and shoot the plungers. Stick them on people. Got the paint blasters, there we go. There's a couple of new additions. Also got the little bouncy pad um inflatables that have out into this. There's also a couple of new little additions. Got the burgers. So these are just throwable objects you can flat people with. Also got the tomato. Some of you the tomato. So just for throwing really a bit of fun. So plastic. Do these here do anything? Let's have. Oh. You have redeploys also. You have Varma signs. As you can see, we do have, yes, indeed, the quad crashes are back. Get over to. Two. So to get yourself one of the quad crashes, just go up to the vending machine as always and claim it. So fantastic. So at the back here you can 
yourself with this. By going on these, you can actually collect yourself more ammo. See, my gun has now got 14. You know, keep doing the purple paint launcher, orange paint, whatever you want to do. We'll keep ammo too. Now, as you can see, I do have a good little thing. As I did say, we do have the quad crashers. The ways very fun, very good. They do have the boost option. Ways, there we go. You can obviously do yourself some races. The best is. Go for the quad crashers. So right over here, you can see these disc lights. Do have a little bit of a party zone. We'll get over them. We will have a scriptures. We have an arrow of top of the butchers. This actually is, shall we? There we go, look at that. To the rings. And land on the design area. Too bad, not too. Go over to disco area. Get over there. You have areas for your speedboats, also as you can see. So, and obviously, a lot of stuff here. There we go. Look at that. Very good. But to show you the hoverboards back again. Don't actually know if these are back though, which just might be a bit of a hint. You never do know, guys. There we go. So it does show you different um, loading screens from the previous um, seasons that we've done. It's fantastic. But also that could be a clue to what people are saying about going back to previous maps. Or you can just come here like everyone else and have a bit of a dance. Fantastic. Let's have another quick butchers. See what else we can find. As you do see, we do have zip lines and we also have the battle bus. The battle bus is down on the landing pad. Quite good. Unfortunately, you cannot build or anything on this, but anybody out there can for this just, just a little bit. Yo, we can explore Battle Bus, look at this. You for Battle Royale. Wait, for leaving? That's executed. Royale must be the way regular normal game. Quite a good little um, addition also. else do we or burgers or tomatoes tomatoes do have an array array yeah this is party by our game come along do enjoy it also do let me know down in the comments think of this 
do further update to what's actually going on, yeah, do let me know. So last but not least, with the 12.50 update, Risky Wheels was indeed blurred out with the question marks. I don't know how many of you actually did notice this. Mine isn't um, blurred out because I've actually been to the location earlier to try and find it. Unfortunately, I couldn't find it. So if any of you do know what it was or do know what's been changed, please do comment down below in the comment section and let us all know. It would be fantastic. So thank you for everybody for watching this video. I've been Dunfella Slinger and I will catch you all very soon.